and look who we have joining us this morning. <laughs> hey. Good morning, everybody. Thank yeah. you for joining us. Thank you for having me. And we love seeing your story here, especially the fact that you were telling me you want more people to know about your grandfather. Absolutely. Very yeah. important to me. I feel like his story is um, underappreciated. Yeah, and you know, you talked about new music. What else can we expect coming up? Well, I dropped a song today. Ooh, yeah, it's called Home oh, One. Yeah, perfect timing. <laughs> as well as some educational videos. I just uh, made a step into that realm. So my mom is a teacher. So oh, we released awesome. um, some kids music and videos on YouTube. Wow. Alim's Funky Number Facts and Alphabets. So go on my YouTube page. Yeah, well, really cool. Well, that's really creative. Mm -hmm. It's a great way, I think, to get people or kids, especially to learn something different if they're mm -hmm. listening in it, to it in a way that they would resonate with. Yeah, I exactly. think she'll put it on for her kids later uh, 100%. Today. <laughs> Please do, yeah, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> Well, we got the morning mix, and you're going to be staying here with us. Can't wait to do yes. it. Yeah, in fact, let's kick off right here with the first story. And this is maybe something that, I don't know if you saw the Grammys this year, mm -hmm. but they had this great hip-hop tribute, 50 yeah. years of hip-hop. So it's been talked a lot about on social media about this particular list. Since we're celebrating 50 years of hip-hop, Billboard came out with their version of their 50 greatest rappers of all time. So here are the top 10. So at number 10, it's Nicki Minaj. Number nine is Snoop Dogg. Number eight is Drake, seven, Lil Wayne, and six, Notorious B.I.G. Okay, so top five. Here we go. Eminem, number five. Tupac, number four. Three is Nas. Two, Kendrick Lamar. And number one is Jay-Z. Bay Area's E-40, by the way, ranked at number 41. So I am Sue, since you're hanging out with us, you're a special guest. What did you think of the list? What do you think of that top ten? Did they get it right? I think everyone is entitled to their opinion, yeah. and every <laughs> list changes. That's what I say when I don't want to say something. <laughs> well, well, I answer. personally, if I had to say, Lil Wayne should be higher. Really? But okay. Yeah, I think everyone is entitled to their opinion. I what, agree. Yeah. Because I felt uh, Dr. Dre, in particular, for me, it's what like number 40, mm -hmm. 41 on the list, and I feel like he was so influential on just bringing a different sound to hip hop and rap with lyrics and music when he did it, and discovering like Snoop Dogg and things like that. So I feel like he should be a little higher, in my yeah. opinion. So I'm with you. You know, I think there's everyone's got their own perspective. Well, I wanted to ask, do you look, when you think about a list, do you think about their style, their lyrics, longevity in their career? What do you, you know, think about when you think of greatest rappers, greatest rappers so of all time? I think all of those factors play a role. Um, originality is important mm -hmm. to me. Mm -hmm. um, lyrics always. Uh, beat selection, I okay. think, is very important. So I think it's a lot of things that play into being a top rapper. Yeah. Well, being from the Bay Area, I think E-40 should have been higher. Right. Yeah. I mean, maybe we're right. a little biased, though. Yeah. Just yeah. a little yeah. biased. All right. Really quick, let's talk about this. The way we listen to music has changed a lot, even in the last decade. Do you feel like the differences in how you hear it online with Spotify and things like that make a difference in music? Absolutely. And mm -hmm. it's um, way quicker. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So many songs come out every day. I think like 50,000 songs. So and a new one different. today. Yeah, exactly. For, and for me, mm -hmm. a new one today. So yeah, that, from the CD era to yeah. this, definitely is way faster to pace. And it allows awesome. people to stay independent, too, mm -hmm. having all of these platforms, right? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. You can go straight from your laptop or your phone mm -hmm. and have the world listening to your music. Well, That's thank amazing. you for coming in. And also, thank you, thank you to your mama for coming yeah, in, too. She's the yeah. <laughs> support. Thank Thanks you. for sharing your story with us. Absolutely. We appreciate it. I think it's important for people to know it.